Hi, it's Sue from Kind Living. There's a lot of cues in a yoga practice that repeated over time may actually create some instability rather than being helpful. A common cue that you hear is to square off the hips. And this is common in postures where there's a wider stance like warrior one or triangle pose. Rob's going to do his version of warrior one, reaching the arms up and getting his front knee close to 90. And some things can happen if I insisted on pressing his right hip forward and the left hip back. Over a period of time, that could create some instability of the sacroiliac joints. Sacroiliac joints, that's where the iliac crest meets this triangular shaped bone called the sacrum. So together they make sacroiliac joints. So if we, rather than forcing his right hip forward and his left hip back, squaring off the hips. If I take a look at the mechanics of his legs here, so he's got nice stacking of the joints, knee over top of ankle, getting his thigh close to 90. Look at that and then allow the pelvis to settle in relation to the position of the legs. Rather than forcing the pelvis around the fixed legs, we allow the pelvis to move in a way that is going to be sustainable for a long period of time. So it's okay that his right hip is back in relation to the left in this case. He's got structural integrity of the back of the pelvis and he's got nice stacking of the joints. So one cue you just may wish to reconsider is squaring off the hips. Certain postures, it may not be the best idea. Give it a try. Namaste.